Good morning, everybody. Welcome to another day of Mark Port, brought to you by Mike Bjork. Today is Tuesday, January 12th. Hey, uh, we do got a couple items here today. We'll start off with the NFIB Small Business Index. This is basically a confidence, a, a measure of the confidence level on the small business side, which is important primarily because they make up most of the uh, uh, jobs out there in the U.S. here. So if you look back in November, we had a 94.8, and it actually went up in December. So good news right there. They're feeling a little bit more comfortable where things are going. Probably the rate hike uh, added to uh, the Fed's rate hike maybe added to the um, confidence level where p if they didn't raise ra uh, raise rates that people might think, okay, maybe the economy isn't as strong as they thought, but with them raising it, I think it kind of provides a little bit more confidence out there. Uh, job openings increased uh, in November as well. As we saw back in October, we had 5.3 million job openings and it increased to 5.4 in November, which is also good news right there. Uh, stock market is a little mixed today. Uh, it, they basically started the morning up, uh, and then uh, as the morning wore on towards noon on the East Coast time, uh, or mid morning here in the uh, West Coast, uh, only in the NASDAQ is actually up a little bit. They're up about seven right now, whereas everybody else went to negative territory. And of course, uh, oil is playing a role in that. It's dropped down to about 30 bucks a barrel right now. Uh, bond market, uh, don't, that red one, don't worry too much about that. We had what they call bond rollover yesterday, which translate a, about a 28, uh, 28 points, basis points uh, swing in there. So it doesn't translate to any worse pricing with that. Be so basically where we left off yesterday was about minus 18 base points from where we left off on Friday. Uh, so basically where we left, where we started the morning off when we did this report yesterday. Uh, basically what this means is that they package up the um, they recast and they have package up the bundles of uh, mortgage-backed securities and some on Wall Street and they restart. So basically the market would have been 20 base points lower. Uh, today we're having a big rally. We're getting a kind of a boost from the New York Fed buying mortgage-backed securities. We're up about 34 basis points so far this morning. And right now we're teetering just over the, uh, the um, 200 day mark. So we'll see if we can stay above it. We didn't do it yesterday. We were above it at one point, but uh, as the day wore on, uh, it pulled back and we closed below the 200 day moving average. So hopefully we can see if we can uh, close above it and try to uh, get, get a little momentum for better rates to come. All right, folks. Hey, thanks so much for watching. We do have better rates today, which is obviously the good news. And uh, we'll look forward to seeing you guys tomorrow. Take care. Bye bye.